In this problem, we have to take some numbers and convert them into powers of 10 scientific notation. It's useful to remember that typically, scientific notation is written so that the coefficient, the number on the outside, is between 1 and 10. Therefore, 1.156 is actually pretty much already in its correct form. We just need to add the power of 10. And if we want to add a power of 10 without actually changing the value, then we add a times 10 to the power of 0, since anything to the power of 0 is 1. So this shows us a power of 10 notation for the value, but doesn't actually change the coefficient at all. For 21.8, now we have a coefficient outside of our 1 to 10 range, but it will still be easy enough to fix. We'll just need to move the decimal point from after the 1 to after the 2, because then we'll have our value here for the coefficient being between 1 and 10. And then we will use our power of 10 to balance that and make sure that the value of the number itself hasn't actually changed. So if I were to write 2.18, then the number has decreased from 21.8. But if I increase the order of magnitude by 10 by adding times 10 to the power of 1, then we're multiplying the number by 10 to increase it back to its original value. For point zero zero six eight, it's a bit trickier, but still not terribly complicated. To make this value follow our criteria, we'll need to move the decimal place three spaces to the right, which will increase the number's value. So our order of magnitude should have a negative number to decrease the value in turn, because now I've increased it by changing it from 0 0.0068 to 6.8. So since we increase the coefficient by an order of magnitude of 3, then the power of 10 should move its order of magnitude back down 3. So the full value becomes 6.8 times 10 to the negative 3. For 328.65, we have to move the decimal place to the left two spaces. One, two. Following the method we've been using, this becomes 3.2865. Then to change it back with the power of 10, we add times 10 to the power of 2, because this will equalize our values again. For point two one nine. The decimal place only moves one space to the right, with its order of magnitude moving back down once to cancel it out. So this number in scientific notation is 2.19 times 10 to the power of negative 1. For 444, we change this to 444 effectively moving the decimal space twice to the left, so we multiply this by 10 to the second power to even this value out. And those are all the values written in powers of 10.